Abe, what are you doing here? May I come in? We said everything we need to say earlier, didn't we? If you could just give me a moment. All right. Wow, you've really changed the room around. What do you want, Eve? Divorce papers. I signed them. You didn't have to bring them by. You could have mailed them. I know. I was just hoping. TC, do you want me to put this with all the other things going to the dump? To the dump? TC, you can't throw those away. Those. Those are our wedding pictures. I don't want them. Well, I know, but someday the girls might want to see them. They're memories of our wedding. The girls aren't going to want to see pictures of our wedding. They don't want anything to do with you. And neither do I. I think you should leave now. You don't belong here anymore. So go to your lover and his mansion. In fact, I know Julian is waiting for you outside, so go. Go to him. Julian, I'm not done here yet. Oh, maybe you didn't hear me the first time I said it. No one wants you here, so get out. Not yet. I have something to say, and you are going to listen to me. You must be a glutton for punishment, because I know I told you to get out. I'll get out. After I have had my say, I'm getting a little bit tired of being the villain, of being the monster in all this. Yes, I made mistakes. Yes, I will regret them for the rest of my life. But I didn't ruin this marriage all by myself. You have a responsibility too, TC. Oh, my goodness, the nerve. After everything you've done, you have the gall to blame TC? Oh, honey, I'm not blaming TC. Just for part of it, I am blaming you for the rest of it. You who came here only to steal my husband. That's a lie. Oh, please. It's not like you haven't been obvious about trying to steal him. What if I told TC everything? What if I told him about how you deliberately and methodically set out to destroy my marriage? What about that, TC? Would you like to hear the truth, the whole truth about Liz? Eve, I don't want to hear it, because I wouldn't believe you anyway. That's right, TC. She's nothing but a liar. All right, if that's how you feel, TC. Yes, it, it is. Well, you were right about me. I wasn't honest with you about my past, and that's because I was ashamed of all the terrible things I'd done when I was younger. And no one could be sorrier for them than I am. But I did not know that I was driving that car that hit you. I didn't even remember the accident until recently. Yeah, I guess doing all those drugs really fried your brain. Well, fortunately, I was able to stop doing self-destructive things and turn my life around. I am not making excuses. I know that what I did was wrong. But for God's sake, it was over 20 years ago. What about the last 20 years, TC? Don't they mean anything? I'm not the same mixed-up girl that I was back then. And God knows I have tried to be the best working wife and mother that I could be. But how, Eve? Huh? Lying to me? Keeping secrets? Pretending to be someone that you're not? 
A decent, respectable woman of morals? I am those things, TC! Don't you see that I have always been? I never broke our wedding vows in the, all the years that we were married until you kicked me out of here and kicked me out of your life. Oh, really, Eve? So are you saying that you never sinned in your heart? You never had any feelings for Julian? You never ran off to meet him secretly, and you never kissed him. Tell us, Eve. Tell us you never met secretly with Julian, and you never kissed him. I don't deny it. I know it was wrong. But I never cheated on you, TC. And if you consider a kiss infidelity, then we've both been wrong, haven't we? If you're talking about when Liz and I were... No. This is long before you and Liz slept together. This is long before my past came out. I saw you and Liz kissing in a youth center. And I know it wasn't the first time. So you better look at yourself if you're gonna throw stones at me. So no one here is innocent. You saw us? Yeah. I couldn't say anything. Even though I knew exactly what Liz was doing because she was blackmailing me. You know, threatening to tell you about my past. And so I just forgave you. Because my marriage... was the most important thing in the world to me. So I just thought that I would come here and try one more time to reach you, see if I could save our marriage, but I, I can see it's, it's no use. It's over, so. You want a divorce, TC, so there you go, you got one. I'm not gonna fight you, and I, uh, I won't bother you again. 